Whenever I have an inspiration for a magical musical idea or I want to write uh, musical examples for my students uh, or just my own pieces, uh, I just open up uh, MuseCore and it is easy to use. Hi guys, so welcome to Web Piano Academy. In this video I'm going to share with you a simple and inexpensive way to write uh, your own music uh, on the computer or to copy some exercises or to invent your own exercises uh, in a very very simple way um, without uh, touching the keyboard, uh, without having a keyboard. Uh, let's go and try! see how to cook a magical piece of music. The secret lies in the blend of spices like music notation, music theory, a good ear inspiration, paper and pencil, and instrument maybe, and then a good softer notation for the witchcraft to happen. I use MuseCore and uh, it is very easy to use for everybody and it is free. So the ingredients are inspiration, music theory, some confidence, a piano or a keyboard, which is optional, and a software to write notation. If you have all this, you're ready to go. Now go ahead and download MuseCore if you still don't have it on your computer. Now, to download MuseCore, you need to go to musecore.org, download, and then I have Windows, so I will download Windows, but if you have um, an Apple computer, anything else, just download whatever it is um, good for your computer. Click download. And I already have MuseCore on my computer, so I won't um, wait for that, I, will, I want to install it, but you have to install it first. Now, when you open MuseCore, you will see something like that. Go to create new score, add the title, we just add test title, you can add subtitle, composer, and whatever else you want, but these are information that you can also add a little bit later. And go to next. As you see, we can uh, choose the instruments. We will have a choral, chamber music, solos, and so on, orchestral, band, percussion. Because this is a piano channel, we will use a grand stuff. Now let's go to next. Here we can pick the key signature and eventually the tempo, but we won't change that for now. So let's do that in C major. Go to next. We'll leave it in four quarters. The pickup measures we will just get to for the sake of this video we will go to BB8 measures only. Otherwise the video will take forever. So finish. So here is our test score. Now the problem here that we have is to understand how to input notation which is very simple. We go to this N, N as notation. Okay, so now let's imagine that we want to write a very simple melody that I'm not inventing right now, but let's do something in C major. So let's take a quarter note and let's input the C and then the D, E, C, D, E, and then I want a half note, I will take the half note. And then I will continue with the quarter notes. And then a 
let's go to the E and half note again. Now let's imagine I want to add a rest, okay? Now let's repeat that same melody with some rests in between. And then uh, if I want a rest here, a quarter rest, take the quarter note, take the rest, and we have a rest here. Then I want another note. Well, the rest is already there. Let's imagine that now I want to have a D here. And then another D. And then let's start this with the rest. Take the rest. And then I continue. Now I want another rest. And then let's take a whole note here. Okay, so now let's go ahead and write some accompaniment. So I can write chords if I want. Uh, let's do that for the first four measures. So we will write just whole notes and then we will see some chords. Okay, so now let's try some chords. And then I will change to the G chord maybe. And another C chord maybe here. I don't know. Now, if I would like to listen how that sounds, I will go back and play. Okay, now that we have written our own music, let's imagine that we want to export it. So we go to File, Export, and we can export that as a PDF file, but also, as you see, as an MP3 audio or as you see, there are different options too. So let's see, MP3 audio, save. It will be saved, so you can use this kind of music as your own recording. Now go ahead and have fun with the MuseScore. See you in the next video. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel and to like this video. Thank you, bye. Thank you.